Oh, there's a lot of waiting around, but you know, it's, it's part of the competition, particularly here in Bangalore, you often get little showers like that, so it's certainly no excuse you know, to, to not be prepared for it. And to be fair, I thought we were prepared for it. You know, we started well with the bat and with the ball, and you know, the, these short games like that, they can go either way. Uh, we thought it was enough, but you know, when you got Gail Coley, um, De Villiers, and then the way Mandy played there, um, you, you know, you're never guaranteed of a, of a result. But we thought we batted really well, you know, to, to go at, at over 10 and over in, in a short game like that. Um, and to be fair, we thought we bowled really well as well. We just had our debrief there. We, we batted and bowled well. And, you know, sometimes guys are allowed to play out of their skin, and we kind of feel we've been beaten by a really good batter in the end there. Yeah, you're right. Um, in the middle, it's it's very tight now. I think RCB have just gone ahead of us on run rate, probably, and you know the Sunrisers are playing at the moment as well, so they could sneak up as well. So there's there's four big games to go. Uh, you know, we've got two at home, which is is going to be important. Um, we've been pretty good at home, but you know the pressure's on now. And we're, we're at the business end of the tournament, so you know it's not a bad time to find find a bit of form and find your groove. Um, so you know we've. We feel we've done well to, to stay in the race at this point. We, we've lost a few close games, but we're certainly up there with the, with the leading pack. And you know, the next 10 days is, is going to decide our fate and, and if we progress into those last four.